Access all areas. I'm Mr. Jam and this is my guide to DJing on the radio. 7 o'clock across the UK, my name is Mr. Jam. Welcome to your ultimate One Extra source for brand new music. This is BBC Radio One Extra. Number one, know your equipment. Most nightclubs will have this. This is a industry standard setup of CD decks, and mixer, and underneath, turntables, old school turntables. A mixer, each one of these is a channel of audio. So what I'd have to do is I load in music to my CDJ. Now that can either come on a CD, or it can come on the form of an SD card that just allow you to go into a nightclub or a radio show with as much music as is on here. Play in the pause button, the Q button, that will take you back to a cue point that you set. You've got over here, your tempo section. If I move this up, plays it faster. If I move it down, it'll play it slower. And that will allow me to be able to mix two different records together because not every record will run in the same tempo. Number two, music theory. Learn the basics. So most modern music is written with four beats to the bomb. Let me show you. One, two, three, four, two, two, three, four, three, two, three, four, four, two, three, four. I've just played you four bars of music. And the way that you know that is that you can count quite evenly between the spaces. So, for example, with this, you're going one, two, three, four, two, three, four, two, three, four, two, three, four. Number three is structure. Get to know the makeup of your music. This is the point where you start learning the song so you know where the record is about to do something different. If you're on radio, you'll know the points where you can talk over the record without it sounding like you're fighting with the vocalist on the record. And the DJ environment, whether you're in a nightclub, you know the points where you can mix in and mix out. I've been playing this record in the background. I know I have until the waveform changes before the beat kicks in. And I also know because I can count bars that the beat is about to come in right. I have this record. I have this record. They both run at completely different times. So if you were to play them together, it doesn't work. If you stick within the genre, it might work with each other. So for example, this is a house record. That's another house record. They mix. It sounds pleasing. This is a system that we use here at BBC Radio 1 Extra and Radio 1 called VCS. It's basically like iTunes, where you can load in the music that you want. So in here, I have a list of probably around about 60 tracks from which I can choose which records I'd like to play throughout the course of my show. Number six, make sure your music is appropriate for your audience. Daytime on Radio 1 or 1 Extra, you wouldn't expect to hear people say, your mum. And that was Duke Jamont featuring Jack Jones with I Got You. The next record is the new one from Charlie Sloth. Ah, no, no, it's not. It's, it's, it's New Drake. Number eight, get your tone right. Speak as though you're speaking to your friend in the room. This is the new record, the new disc from Meridian Jack. Number nine, have regular hooks in your show to keep people listening. In my show, we call these plot points. These are appointment to listen moments that people know are going to happen in advance. Coming up on the show tonight at 7.25, it is the Jam Hot Record of the Week. 7.45, the Radio Ripper. 8 o'clock is all about the Inbox Fresh. And then at 9 o'clock, as always, the Daily Dose Mix. Number 10, and possibly the most important one, have fun. Let me know how we're sounding tonight. Get involved. <laughs> <laughs>